Indeed, 3M has reportedly agreed to a tentative deal of $5.5 billion to settle over 300,000 lawsuits alleging that the company sold defective earplugs to the U.S. military. That's according to Bloomberg. We're seeing the stock, though, not too badly affected there, up about 5.5% on the day. I think perhaps some, some relief there that there is, in fact, a resolution on track, perhaps helping keep the stock afloat today. Absolutely. And, you know, one of, yeah, one of the huge things around 3M that's important to remember, too, especially given the faulty earplugs and um, the five and a half billion dollar settlement to resolve some of those claims here. Uh, the company, we're, we're waiting for more of a response. They're also, of course, in the process of spinning off the healthcare division. That's set to come later on in 2023. So towards the end of the year there. Um, and then additionally, they've kind of had this history of, you know, where some of the, the chemicals, um, that the companies produce and, you know, some uh, that are, you know, ultimately involved in the broader manufacturing. There is kind of a track record or a history where uh, there have been some of these settlements previously in the past. But um, at the end of the day, it'll be interesting to see exactly how investors continue to kind of weigh in around this potentially. But investors, um, perhaps looking at this and saying, all right, it could have been worse. <laughs> so shares are up by about 6.7% right now, Rochelle.